TSR-2, manufactured by British Aircraft Corporation in the early 60s, designed to serve as a supersonic low-level strike and reconnaissance aircraft. With its innovative terrain-following radar system, the aircraft was able to fly low altitudes following the contours of the terrain without being detected by enemy radar. In order to optimize the aircraft's performance, the TSR-2's wing design was swept forward with variable geometry air intakes. The aircraft was able to maintain optimal engine performance even at supersonic speeds. To facilitate effective communication and mission execution, the cockpit layout and instrumentation of the TSR-2 were carefully designed for a crew of two, a pilot and a weapon system operator. Initial flight testing showed promise in terms of performance and capabilities. However, this project faced a myriad of challenges. Why did this cutting-edge project fail to take flight? Panavia Tornado a more versatile solution aimed at addressing modern warfare's changing demands. Result of the collaborative effort by NATO nations. Still, what makes the TSR-2 interesting despite its cancellation? A pioneer approach to low-level flight. Additionally, the controversy surrounding its demise has kept the TSR-2 alive in aviation discussions. As we bid farewell to TSR-2, we recognize that its story is not just one of failure, but a tapestry woven with lessons. This cautionary tale serves as a reminder that even the most ambitious projects can be derailed by economic and political obstacles. If you found this journey into the skies of history fascinating, don't forget to like, subscribe, and join us for more tales of times and tribulations in the world of aviation. Until next time, blue skies and happy landings.